China has more than 200 confirmed cases of coronavirus. The number of people infected has tripled to more than 200. Has placed travel restrictions on more cities a day after locking down Wuhan. With cases confirmed in China, Thailand, Japan, and now South Korea. The spread of the coronavirus is accelerating. Hi, my name is Stephen Ping. I live in the UK and uh, about a week ago I travelled to Huan to visit my family for Chinese New Year. And um, today I was diagnosed with the coronavirus, so the doctor tells, <coughs> tells me. There isn't any decent medical facility in Huan. Uh, it's a bit crazy to be honest. And, um, and I, I think this is much more serious than what the media is telling us. So, <coughs> so I'm documenting my conditions um, from within the center of where the virus apparently started. <coughs> <coughs> my, um, my condition is currently somewhat stable. I uh, have a temperature of just over 38, 38.1 Celsius. So I guess not too bad. It's like, um, it feels like a common flu <coughs> at the minute. Oh, I just, I just feel, I just feel weak. Just, it's, um, it's been three days now and my condition's got worse. I'm constantly shivering and always cold and hot, cold and hot, you know. It's, it's just like a bad flu, so. so I'm hoping it'll pass. There's, um, there's something else I wanted to share. Um, I tried to go to one of the hospital <coughs> yesterday and um and there was just there was just queue for meters and meters and and there were bodies lying around the building and just just no one there to help i couldn't even get close to the hospital you know <sighs> just <coughs> it was just a total chaos and the media isn't reporting this i don't know why because they need to know you know what what the, what the situation is like in here There are no travel restrictions across China and um, Wuhan is on total lockdown. Um, I, um, I have no appetite. I haven't eaten for a day now. And, uh, and the food is low anyway, so, you know, I guess, I guess I don't need it. Um, I really don't know what to do. Level 1 health emergency was declared today across <coughs> 10 provinces. Some of you may know that um, Wuhan is building a hospital. It's not a fucking hospital. I went to the site yesterday and they're building this facility to store all the bodies. We were shipping thousands of bodies to the site. And I'm wondering, you know, when am I gonna end up there? And why is the media lying to us? Why can't I just tell the truth? <coughs> Good news, I feel almost recovered today. Um, I had some time to go out and get some food supplies because uh, looting has started in Wuhan and uh, almost everywhere in China. Um, I heard that in the news the infection has spread it everywhere in the world now. Um, I guess I guess I'm the lucky one. Ah. Fuck! 
Ah. Um. Um. I don't know what's going on, but um. Ah. It's um. Somehow I'm bleeding from the eyes. The nose. Um. I. Ah. I mean pain. Oh. Uh. What's happening? What the fuck is happening to me? <laughs> hey, it's the end of the world. <laughs> Um, the World Health Organization has declared as a pandemic. <laughs> it's too fucking late. And um, the broadcasting has stopped today, so I have no idea what's going on the rest of the world. I haven't heard from my family or friends for well over the day now. So I guess this could be my last recording. Um, it's not the virus that's killing people anymore. It's people killing people. If you find this recording, I um, guess let this be a lesson to you. It's just nature's way of balancing the population. Because we are destroying the planet. 